Hello, my name is Kiana James. I am Math 2050. Um, we're going to be showing you how to do, how to use an abacus. Today we'll be using two different abacus. The Sylvonic abacus or the base 10 abacus and the base four. We're gonna start off with our base 10 abacus, which problem we're going to do is 7,612 plus 6,478. So you see here that all of my beads have been set up. We have two in the ones, one in the tens, six in the hundreds, and this is supposed to be seven in the thousands. Now to add, we're going to add just like normal, just like we would do with regrouping. So on the first one, we want to add eight into the ones place. So two, four, six, and eight. We notice that this equals a 10. So 10 ones equals one 10. So we push up a 10 here. Next, we're going to add a 7 to our 10s. So 1, sorry, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7, and 7. Now, we're going to add four to our hundreds. So we have one, two, three, and four beads here. So we're going to push all of these up. Now, we do notice that, again, once again, we have all 10 beads up. So what we're going to do is go ahead and regroup into our thousands and push all of these down to zero. Now... We need to add six in our thousands. So one, two. We notice that we have 10 up here. So we're gonna push all of these down and regroup in our 10 thousands. Three, four, five, and six. Now we have our answer, which is 14,090. 14,090. Now we're going to subtract using an abacus. So we're going to be subtracting 5,612 minus 3,478. So I'm going to go ahead and set my abacus with two in the ones, one in my tens, six in my hundreds, and five in my thousands. Subtracting follows the same rules as addition, although they are a tad bit different. So for subtracting, we want to get rid of eight. In this first problem we want to get rid of eight so in order for us to do that we're going to go one two okay and instead of adding a one when we regroup we're taking one away and three four five six Now we are going to subtract with our abacus. Now we have our problem set up. 5,612 minus 3,478. On our abacus, we put five in our thousands, six in our hundreds, 
one in our tens and two in our ones. To subtract, it follows the same rules, just a little bit differently. We are still regrouping, but instead of adding one when we regroup, we are taking away one. So one, two, we're going to regroup, okay, and take away our one. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. We took away eight from our ones. Now we're going to take away seven. We don't have any here to take away from. So we go ahead and regroup. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. That leaves us three in our ones place. Now we're going to go ahead and take away four from our hundreds. So one, two, three, and four. And now we're going to go ahead and take away and take away three from our thousands. So one, two, and three. Our final answer should be 2,134. Again, 2,134 should be our final answer. Now I am completely done with my base 10 abacus, so we're going to move on to our base 4. For our base 4 abacus, you notice that the beads on here are only 4 beads on each row. That is the most amount that you can put on a row on a base four abacus, just as for instance, a base 10, the most amount of beads that you can put is 10. Because if we have four here and we go ahead and regroup, that four made one. So same rules apply as our base 10. Now we're going to do three, 1,132 base 4 plus 1,222 base 4. To do that, we do just as we have done with our base 10 abacus. So we're going to go ahead and add 2 to the 2 that are already here. That made 4. So we're going to go ahead, regroup, and add 1 to our 10. We do notice that when we regroup to our tens that we also have made one. So that means that our hundreds have to go ahead and regroup as well. So once we do that, we're going to go ahead and add one and two. Now we have to add two to our hundreds. So one Two, we're going to go ahead and regroup because four makes one. And we notice, and that zero does out. Now we notice that all four beads for our thousands are, in fact, in our column. So we're going to go ahead and regroup and add one. Our final answer is 11,010, 11,010.